George Washington. Is George Washington Arnold from up there around Peck and Poor, Idaho? Because our people, you know, we're mixed. Did she tell you that? We are one quarter Korean and half black and a quarter Hachapena Indian. This is my grandmother, Miss Lavata Washington. She had 22 children, and then she died. Well, there was nothing else she could do. I loved my grandma. These are all the Washington children here, lined up, ready for church. All my sisters and brothers graduated from college. I paid for it and was happy to do it. We couldn't be closer. You know, it's ironic, isn't it, that you sent your entire family to school, and yet, growing up in show business, you basically received no education at all. Do you... Do you sometimes feel cheated out of your childhood? I don't feel cheated out of anything. All right, I can't add or subtract, but... Uh, growing up on the road, I learned a lot about life. And in the end, isn't that all the learning that really matters? Jackie, out of your entire family in Kinloch, only your sister Ethel agreed to be interviewed. Now, why is that? I bet that Ethel told them not to talk to you. Everybody's scared of Ethel, except me. I ain't scared of Ethel. Yeah, okay, look. She paid for me to go to school. I appreciate that. But what's the big deal? I mean, she's my sister, she's rich, she had the money. Doesn't change the fact that she's a dog, a low-down, dirty, dirty dog. And you know, let me tell you something about Miss Jackie Washington, okay? She ain't sh Oh, no, I'm not bitter. Mm-mm. No, if I was bitter, she'd be dead. I mean, God bless her. She's my sister. She's my sister. But you know, it rains every time we have Jackie Washington Day in the neighborhood. I didn't want to say that, but y'all are here, you know, doing a documentary on her. Like she's some this big thing. She's been gone a while, huh? People on Jackie Washington Day, they just die. Mm -hmm. You didn't know that, did you? No, of course not. Nobody talks about it. People just at the washing machine doing laundry. Boop. Jackie Washington today. Dead. Oh, oh, I gotta tell you, honey. They love me and kill me. But it is so good to be home. Woo! I told you, baby, run my bath, will you? I am exhausted. Kim Law will wear you out. You want bubbles? Yeah, bubbles, oils, and those dead sea salts, too, baby. Please. Mm -hmm. She's the best, isn't she? <laughs> Every mother should have an entendre. Woo! Oh. Oh. Jackie, I think it's time we talked about, um... <clears throat> oh, gosh, I, I, I'm, I'm really not sure how to put come this. Come on, Edward, come on now. No more questions about my sex life. I'm beginning to think I'll turn you on. I'm just doing my job, Miss Washington. <laughs> I see that glint in your eye. Is that a little spark between us? You're a very attractive woman, Jackie. But we need to focus here. Tell me about being washed up. Bankrupt. Broke. Well, you certainly know how to sweet talk a woman. By the end of the 80s, Peaches Yancey was played out up to his eyeballs in money troubles. Yeah, yeah, he had the IRS, Vegas bookies, and bounty hunters hunting him down. My career suffered because of it. I was desperate for a gig. Any gig. Any gig, indeed. Jackie was in a downward spiral. What she couldn't have known was how far she would have to fall before she hit rock bottom. By the time she was 30, show business had left her standing out in the car world. Still, as the song says, she wouldn't trade it for a pot of gold. And so you had to fire Peaches Yancey. Oh, 
was the hardest thing I ever did in my life. He was the well from which my career drank deeply. Oh, the pain. But I had no choice. I, who had Grammys, a star on the Hollywood Walk of Fame, my image award was broke. I was selling my Bob Mackie gowns at yard sales. But then you found a new manager. See, all Jackie needed was a big-time, high-profile gig. And I had connections inside the Bush White House because I'd done a little savings and loan deal with Neil Bush. Anywho, they were having this charity brunch for Millie Bush. She's the cute little cocker spaniel. May she rest in peace. So I called in a few favors, and I got Jackie to sing. Jackie, is it true that at the White House you called Barbara Bush Millie? Hey, what I told you, I didn't want to talk about that Bush thing. That was a simple mistake, all right? I cannot be expected to remember every presidential dog. Besides, Millie and Barbara have the same hair. Oh, my God, look at this stage. I am back where I belong. I'm Tondra Cam. Look, this stage is mine. This stage belongs to me. Who are these skinny boys? They're your dancers, Mama. These are dancers? This is all we could afford. Are they rehearsed? Yes, Mom. Take it from the top. Yeah, honey, listen. And this is not just some ditty number I'm doing, all right? This is Love Goddess. Yeah, yeah, I know. I'm telling you, baby, what do you think about this? This lighting? It's, it's all wrong, Mama. Way too blue. Really? Too blue? You need some bastard amber. You heard the girl. I'm gonna need some bastard amber. I got it. Bastard. Oh! <laughs> 